Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to a slightly more relaxed uh, Sunday uh, afternoon episode of Ted's Boo Cellar with me, Ted. Now today we're going to go for something a little bit more lighter than the last few episodes just because, you know, considering it's a lazy Sunday afternoon, you know, we're not going to go too heavy. And, you know, I spent most of today so far, you know, working on applications for a bunch of things and, uh, you know, sending out applications to societies as well here in Brighton. So, you know, kind of just had a busy day of work, really. Haven't played any video games yet. And I'm going to, I just want to kind of decompress. Uh, so I picked this up in the supermarket earlier. I've never had it, but it's a take on a drink that I usually do really enjoy. It's Espresso Martini by Kahula. And this is, this is quite interesting because I do really like, um, espresso martini and I've tried Kahula's products before and they are usually really nice uh, now this is um, in it it's got uh, co coffee uh, coffee liqueur vodka uh, caviar cav I don't know what that is ja vodka blended cocktail med cafe caf liqueur and ok bunch of crazy stuff really but uh yeah no it's um it's qu it's quite interesting because I'm um, Kahula dabbling non-dairy products and I really like espresso martinis so I'll be interested to see how this is I fancied something with a little bit of alcohol in it to sort of like reward me for like uh you know doing a bunch of applications today and doing a bunch of hard work and but you know I also wanted something just to give me a bit of a pick-me-up as well because it's still only about a uh, quarter to six. So, you know, something with a bit of caffeine in it might be handy. Uh, a lot of people say they don't like espresso martinis, but I do really like them myself. Uh, sometimes I really enjoy having one with a croissant, actually. That's a really nice little treat. Uh, perhaps not the healthiest, but, you know, it's nice. Uh, so, yeah, this is 4.5% uh, alcohol volume. So, strong-ish, but not too strong. So, uh Ooh, yeah, you can smell the alcohol though, definitely. So yeah, let's give it a try. Wow, that's... Yeah, I'll be honest, that's... Um... I mean, the flavour's kind of there, but it's really poorly mixed. Yeah, that's... Hmm. Yeah, that's really disappointing. God. It's really watery. Um, it's nowhere near strong enough as I thought it would be. Uh, the coffee flavour is barely there. Um, yeah, and I, I've, I've had pre-mixed espresso martinis before that have you know, usually when it's a pre-mixed one, it's not as good as, like, the real thing when you get it in a bar or when you get it, like, mixed for you in front of you by a cocktail artist or something like that. But, yeah, that's really disappointing. I just, I, that is not a buy. Definitely not a buy. It's, like, doesn't work for any category that I think I've got. Might work for decompression and relaxation, but even then it's a real stretch to say it's a buy and my overall rating for it I think has to be hang on oh god I think probably only like a 3 out of 10 but barely like really it's close to even being a 2 or even a 2.5 like this is pretty poor yeah, no, if you want to get espresso martini, look elsewhere. Hell, even go to a pub and get one there, because it'd probably be nicer anyway. Maybe with proper ingredients and mixed together by someone who knows what the hell they're doing, other than a damn machine. Anyway, yeah, that's really disappointing. In any case, if you guys did enjoy this video, uh, leave a like, share, and subscribe. Uh, leave a comment in the comment section below for uh, any suggestions you guys have for uh, future videos, whether it be food reviews, drink reviews, or anything else. And uh, yeah, uh, check out my other social medias, YouTube channels, and my Twitch in the video description below. Uh, and yeah, as always, uh, know your limits, drink responsibly, and I'll see you guys at, on at the bar uh, on.
on the next episode of Ted's Brew Cellar. Bye bye for now. What a waste.